Yeah, we have a degree in photography that is a Bachelor's of Fine Arts. Uh, photography graduates can enter in a lot of different fields. Uh, pretty much every photograph you see in your daily life, somebody got paid to take those photographs. But the major places that most of our students find themselves are in large photographic markets like Los Angeles, New York, and they can go into food photography, fashion photography, photojournalism. Um, we have students that go into uh, wedding photography, um, family portraiture, and then also students that might use photography just as a creative outlet or they might seek a career in education so then they go on to get their graduate degree and teach. So the skills that you would develop as a photography major are actually uh, most people think of photography as learning how to operate a camera and learning how to use lights and that's certainly part of it but uh, those mechanics are fairly easy to learn and they're becoming more and more uh, democratic uh, meaning that photography is kind of available to everybody so we'll teach you those things we'll teach you how to use a camera how to use lights how to use the software but more than that we teach you how to communicate visually and a lot of people start learning how to communicate uh, verbally when they're two years old but a lot of people don't give a lot of thought as to how to communicate visually and so that's what we spend a lot of time teaching well i'm not sure if there are very many similar majors at byu we have the theater and media arts where uh, it's predominantly movies or moving imagery and we also teach video in our photography program here because that's a major part of the visual communication but uh, that what makes us different is um, we actually have the equipment and so the students are making um, short videos uh, feature length videos and as opposed to just the theory of movie making they're actually making the images I guess if you don't want to spend your life in a windowless office staring at a computer screen, but want to engage in the world around you in a very personal, tactile way, then maybe photography is for you. Or if you want to influence uh, the world around you with your own visual voice, uh, then photography might be for you. But if you're not ready to work hard, and I mean really hard, um, then go be a doctor or a lawyer because um, the world um, is not uh, inviting you to be a part of it. You have to kind of make your own way.